is going on guys it's your boy Tykeo Kills and we've got a super special treat today especially for my fighting game fans on unboxing with Tykeo Kills so make sure you guys stay locked we've got the Victrix Pro FS Street Fighter Limited Edition Arcade Stick Limited Edition Arcade Stick once I got this thing in guys fucking first thing I did once I got this thing I saw the box it was fucking heavy It was so heavy. I mean, it's heavy, super heavy. Uh, I've got a pump obsidian, and it's pretty heavy. Not this heavy. So first things first, we got a super amazing plastic. Let's go ahead and just rip that off right now. You guys know how we do it. Splash! 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 That's how we rip uh, plastic off here on the unboxing video. This is amazing. Let's check it out here. Let's get this box. Check that out. I'm gonna make sure I get some uh, some better uh, video footage of this at the end, some zoomed in so you guys can see, but check this out. This is amazing. Check out the artwork. On uh, the back, content says we have the Vitrix Pro FS Arcade Fight Stick with authentic Sanwa Denshi Premium Arcade Parts. Shout out to Sanwa. Uh, extra Sanwa Denshi Joystick, Shaft, and Ball Top Grip. Sanwa Base Mounted Link to Detachable Shift Staff or Stick Shaft with Ball Top Attachment. We've got a 9.84 foot by 3 meter detachable braided controller cable with USB C. Sock it to me. Sock it to me. Sock it to me. Controller connection. Gotta love USB-C. Gotta love it. Uh, instruction manual two removable die cast metal T cord wrap extensions attached. An Allen wrench and a character poster. Hmm. Well, hey, without further ado, let's get this bad boy open. Fair no expense uh, with the box. As you guys can see, I love my boxes. I'm a collector. I try to keep all of them. Uh, so that said, I'm gonna try not to. Okay, cool. It's just lift up. I don't have to worry about ripping anything. Oh, God. Oh, my God. Oh. All right, we've got a guile poster. Oh, this is amazing, guys. Check this out. Guile. It's got, it looks like it's got a little character description on it for you guys who don't play Street Fighter. I'm not the biggest Street Fighter fan, but that said, I'm a 90s baby. I didn't grow up around Street Fighter. I did play it often. Shout out to Blanka. Shout out to Ken. Those are my mains back when I was playing. So we've got God. God may look like a God may look like a primitive brawler, one with a flat top hair that is the stuff of 1980s legend. Uh, 80s, 90s, not just 80s. Uh, but in fact, he's also about strategy and finesse. He has the cunning and cool detachment of an angry James Dean. Shout out to James Dean. If you guys don't know who James Dean are, you guys need to Google him. The legendary actor from back in the day, way before I was born. Uh, and his fighting style is all about military discipline. As a military guy, myself, I'm a United States Marine. Gotta love that. I, I, in fact, I wasn't too keen on having the Street Fighter Landed Edition controllers because I, I kind of didn't want care for it really but when i saw this olive drag green and the marine and me just really was just like oh my god you gotta have it bro so uh okay he relies on a real uh, well-rounded defensive arsenal and shows off his flashier moves only when the moment is right in kinu nishimura's sketch uh hopefully i didn't butcher his name uh you can imagine an opponent distracted by gal's raised arms yet missing the real action in his eyes, whereas careful, careful calculation and focus are most evident, in which I, I'll definitely agree. Check that out. You can see he's got his guard up. Uh, I guess you could say one would be distracted by his inglorious arms. I'd say it'd be more distracted by that American flag right there because you guys didn't see America. Yeah. No. All right, so there's the poster. We're gonna sit there where that's inside. Nice and neat. And like I said, I'll get close-ups of this stuff in the end. All right, so we got a nice, is this a box? Okay, no, we've got, oh my God. Uh, the instruction manual. This is an instruction booklet, sir. What? <laughs> Oh, okay, here we go. We got a little thank you card from Victrix. Dear Gamer, we appreciate your support and spending your hard-earned money on our product. It truly means a lot to us when we trust this piece of gaming equipment. Oh, I'm sorry, let me refer. It truly means a lot to us and we trust this piece of gaming equipment will serve you well for a very long time. A tight-knit group of engineers, designers, artists, product managers worked days and nights over several years on the Pro FS program. 
committed to excellence in gaming hardware, we will continue to stand by your side. If you need help, have an issue, or a question about your gear at any point during your ownership, please do reach out to us. It's got this nice little plastic card. All right, let's see what this is about here. Welcome to the next level in gaming hardware. Dude, this is like, this reminds me of a textbook from back in high school, like engineering or something, dude. I don't know. This is amazing. And this isn't an instruction book, but now that I'm looking more and more at it and reading, it's just breaking down the features of the uh, stick and everything that it has. So I'll, I'll just show you all a few so we're not going through the entire booklet here. This is amazing, man. The amount of artistry that they put in here. Uh, let, me, let me swap the page for you guys. See another page there. So there you go. I'll just show you two pages. Boom. Big Purple Big Tricks book. Well put together. Now, it's time for the piece de la resistance, the creme de la creme, if you will. Let's remove those. Oh my god, dude. It's for no expense. So we got our braided USB-C cord that they mentioned us and or told us about. And this is going to be for your PS5 because it is PS5 compatible. And I assume this is why this was included for PS5 and PC application. Okay, here we go. Uh, nice pad, so you can make sure, uh, you know, you can rest sure that your uh, stick is being uh, shipped in safe, uh, a safe package, packaging. All right, give me a second. Because again, I don't like damaging boxes, it'd kill me. All right, there we go. Whip that out nice and slow. Here's the back of the box if you have it soft. Right down here is our ball top, our son of a sheet. Nice. And, and it's going to come with your standard black. Obviously, they're not going to give any wonky colors. I wish they would be creative like that. But yeah, so, but it's still Sanwa, you know, which is definitely the top of the line. Uh, some would argue Hayabusa. It all depends on the play style and who you are. I've never played on a Hayabusa lever, so I don't want to test the Sanwa. But I will try a Hayabusa lever. Check out this nice bag it comes in, man. God. It tricks. Y'all adore yourself. Oh my god. Oh. 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 Guys, check this out. Here we go. Uh, look at this. Holy fuck. Dude. Now, on inspection, I will say it is not as green as I expected it to be, uh, hue-wise, uh, brightness-wise. On Amazon, this looked a lot brighter than what it is here. But let me tell you, I am impressed. I am in no way disappointed. Uh, it's not olive. This is more of a green, a dark green, maybe forest green than it is an olive drab. Definitely not olive drab, but very close forest green. One would even could either uh, even say rain or green. Uh, it's amazing. Check this out. Get in there on that sketch and gonna let you guys see. Fucking amazing. Uh, all Sanwa Denshi push buttons. Now I have uh, Sanwa Silence on my Bomb Obsidian, so probably have to order some more because I don't like those loud clacks. It's already loud enough, darn it. All right, so. In order to, one thing I love about the Quan Book City in here is you can open it up and you can literally change out your buttons in your arcade stick. For anyone that's changed out or, or any arcade stick users, you guys know it's not hard, but it becomes tedious and annoying to swap out and customize buttons and sticks. But you've got to unscrew all those screws, make sure you don't lose them, put it back, and stuff like that. So, hey man, sticks amazing. Again, this is a uh, uh, an unboxing, not necessarily a review. Uh, a review is going to come within a couple of weeks after I've tried it out against my other sticks. Uh, and yeah, guys, so I thank you for tuning in. This has been Unboxing with Taikyo Kills, the uh, Victrix Pro FS Arcade Stick Guile Street Fighter Limited Edition. Thanks for tuning in, guys. It's been real. Taikyo Kills, out.